Okay, hi everyone. So today let's uh, discuss one interesting problem. So it says two waves of equal magnitude A and equal frequency travel in the same direction in a medium. The amplitude of the resultant wave is fine. So when we have two waves in a medium, what will happen? Inka superposition hoga and a resultant wave form hoga. And resultant wave ka jo amplitude hoga that will be under root of A1 square plus A2 square plus twice of a1 into a2 into cos phi what is a1 amplitude of the first wave that is a and a2 is the amplitude of the second wave dono ka same de rakha hai so yahan pe a square plus a square plus twice of a square into cos phi and its uh, root so it will be twice of a square 1 plus cos phi and its root so this will be under root 2 into a into under root 1 plus cos phi now aap dekho कि ये जो एम्पलीट्यूड है, it can be anything. What is given that the two waves are travelling in the same direction, and ये जो phi है, this phi is phase difference, है ना? So if the two waves are travelling in the same direction, doesn't mean कि जो phase difference है वो zero होगा. Phase difference एक completely different चीज़ है. If the two waves are travelling in the same direction, phase difference between the two waves can be anything. फेस डिफरेंस का सेम डायरेक्शन में ट्रैवल करने से कोई रिलेशन नहीं है सो वी कैन से कि ये जो एम्पलीट्यूड है ना ये कुछ भी हो सकता है मैक्सिमम वैल्यू कितना होगा इसका इसका मैक्सिमम वैल्यू होगा कॉस फाइ का मैक्सिमम वैल्यू यहां पे पुट कर दो कॉस फाइ का मैक्सिमम वैल्यू 1 सो इट विल बी 1 plus 1 अंडर रूट 2 इनटू ए इनटू अंडर रूट 2 सो दिस विल बी ट्वाइस ऑफ ए ये आपका मैक्सिमम वैल्यू आ गया मिनिमम वैल्यू कैसे फाइंड आउट करेंगे ए का cos phi ka minimum value that is minus 1 so 1 minus 1 0 ho jayega so it will be 0 so jo amplitude hai of the resultant wave can be anything between 0 to 2a right so i think uh, you have understood let me know if you still have any confusion we can discuss further okay guys keep working hard best of luck bye